Dupe Guru is an amazing software that lets you find duplicate files, pictures, music, and it's free and open source. So that is one of the best parts. Now, there are multiple modes in this uh, Dupe Guru. One of them is standard mode, which uh, is best for all sort of files, maybe PDF, RAR, ZIP, images, music, movies, any kind of file, it will serve the purpose. And uh, there will be instances wherein you will be having hundreds of images and it won't find any duplicates at all because standard uh, mode has its uh, is a different algorithm which basically does that hash uh, hash uh, matches and uh, if they are similar then it won't really find duplicate in them but there is this picture mode which does all the magic so it what it does is it does some fuzzy logic thing and uh, it goes into the picture and analyzes it and uh, tries to find uh, the uh, similar images having the similar pattern and uh, and it just shows you the list of all the duplicate files so the standard mode or the default mo mode it can fail to find the duplicates but picture mode gets into each of the picture and and then shows you the duplicate ones so it's a very powerful tool and interestingly uh, some there were some observations about picture mode which was picture mode don't really support HEIF or raw files at all or even music files so the search will end abruptly and the software will crash just in case you are having any other file formats uh, besides the uh, PNG or JPEG so please take care of that and uh, once you have taken note of that all you have to do is just uh, go to the folder where all the JPEG files or PNG files are and then just run this and it will analyze all of those uh, files and images and it will show you the list of duplicates now interestingly it will show you the original one uh, which has the highest size um, so th that will be retained as the original while all the duplicates uh, which can have different sizes for example original file has uh, 200 kb size while the duplicates have variable size 1000 kb or 500 kb or 250 kb so it will just take the original uh, which has the uh, thousand which has the highest number of uh, kbs or the size so that was very important for me because uh, i didn't want to manually choose uh, which uh, files i have to retain or not and i did a couple of tests before running and actually deleting the uh, pictures so please do that by all means and uh, i am just showing you how i did that so that you will also know okay these are the things which you can uh, take care of so once it has done all the analyzing it will show you the list of all the duplicates possible duplicates uh, so what you can do is you can just check uh, and randomly open each of the files or some of the files and see if uh, the dupe guru has done it well or not and if it has then you can uh, mark them all or send to trash or maybe move it to a different folders and you can name it as duplicates just so that you can again have peace of mind that okay these are the duplicate ones you don't have to touch them forever and and the limited ones which are the left out they are the original pieces so that is something which you can do uh, uh, when you are trying to deduplicate the files or images and uh, it was very exciting to see that 60,000 photos uh, which have been holding for years now uh, reduced to just 10,000 and it will be saving me a lot of time and efforts because I don't have to do any of the things manually like you know manually going through each of the images and checking if they are duplicate of any previous one or not it will be a big game a memory game and etc and Tube Guru was a true savior for me because uh, uh, because when you are having a lot of thousands of images then uh, it becomes a pain to you know manage them and especially when they are having a lot of duplicate files so hopefully this will serve a purpose for you and uh, help you find the duplicate ones over here i saw these many duplicate files in in uh, different folders and uh, it was just too crazy and uh, you can also check the sizes uh, of each of them so these are some random checking which i'm doing i'm just opening random files just to see uh, if these duplicate files are actually duplicate or not uh, because you must have that peace of mind and as you can see the files are almost same so yeah they are worth deleting and and one copy is enough uh, which you can retain for longer period of time so that is what i did and that is what uh, hopefully you can do after taking care of all the other things which you should be uh, doing uh, because uh, it's very important to uh, to do some random tests uh, 
um, because uh, you don't want to lose your precious data and especially when it uh, when it is about uh, pictures it is more about memories and also one thing to notice that at times you will have to run this um, two or three times because then there uh, there will be some images will be which will be left out because of memory con constraints of your computer or uh, the constraints of the dupe guru so then you can rerun it and uh, and uh, find delete all the other duplicate files as well. once you are sure of uh, the duplicate files that okay these are indeed the duplicate files then you can just uh, mark them all and then move them to trash and then further delete them and uh, yes your images will be deduplicated and uh, your life will now be very peaceful now just to recap what you should be observing now is the file sizes of the duplicates and the original files or images and you will observe that uh, the original image has the highest size followed by all the duplicate files which have the lower size than that and that is very important to note because uh, you don't want to uh, retain a low resolution original image because uh, that's not how it works so you need to retain the highest quality uh, image and that will be um, because of the highest size of uh, the image so please ensure that by doing this random check and uh, that is what i do always always whenever i run this tube guru i always check uh, for the any issues it uh, can possibly cause later on so yeah always do that and if you're not sure just uh, move those files uh, to a new folder uh, dupe guru has that option as well uh, that will help you in maintaining your sanity and your original data and once you're comfortable with that just mark all the duplicate images and then send to trash or send to any other folder like we have covered earlier so just recapping all of that and just so that you can understand it in much better way and if the files are too many then it will take a while to send all of those to trash but eventually it will save you thousands of hours if you're having that many photographs so it's a it's a boon the software is a boon and i love it so much thanks so much for watching this tutorial if you liked it please subscribe to our youtube channel and if you didn't then leave a comment so that we can improve it further do watch these suggested tutorials to learn even more and do let us know what you want to learn on being skilled